on a track to do a weekly vlog so if you're new here my name is Bikana and I am a traveler a real estate agent a flight attendant a business owner a lifestyle vlogger a tiktoker um, yeah so welcome to the family if this is your first video I really appreciate you for clicking on it and if you have any comments or questions just drop them down below and like up the video so more people can see we are heading to Chicago today for a turn so that means we're gonna go to Chicago and come right back I think we have a two hour ish sit time the plane is delayed so that sit time will get shorter and shorter <laughs> as we go on but we may make up time in disguise that's something that's really cool that I didn't know planes used to do because I just would go on a plane put on my headphones and just be distracted to the whole world but yeah we can make up time in flight so that's also really interesting one of my classmates is on the flight with me and I just had a classmate on a previous flight like literally my, my previous flight I had another classmate so I think that is just so cool um, I love flying with familiar faces and fun people and I know he's really really fun like that guy is so funny love his personality um, anywho uh, I have my mic on so I'm really really hoping my mic is picking up like beautiful sound because I've, I've fiddled with it on and on and on and on so I really think it's supposed to be picking up great sound now and then the next thing today uh, one of the most important things today is our Independence Day for Jamaica I really 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 wish I would be at home right now celebrating with my mom like watching something cooking some food because it also is a Sunday um, but I'll be back home tonight like probably around midnight or 11 30 because we're supposed to come in around 10 10 30 uh, but today is independence so happy independence to all my beautiful Jamaicans wherever you are in the world whether you're there Yad or you're there America England whether you're there Peru Bali girl whether you're there Scotland or Australia happy independence day to you big up yourself we're little but we're Talawa and our island nation is just so beautiful and it wouldn't be beautiful without us i mean honestly it kind of is beautiful without us but we make it what it is like jamaicans is jamaica is jamaicans if you understand you understand but anyways that is my little rant um stay tuned for the rest of the video I will try to show you what I can but if you are new here and I've said it before in all my other flight attendant videos which you can check out here or it may be up here or you can also check the description box down there I vlog before anybody comes on the plane I don't vlog when passengers are on the plane I don't play those games I really really do love this new career field that I've stepped into I do create content for social media and you've been my B-Squad, you've been my family from before I became a flight attendant, so you'll always be my family. Another note on that, I met two amazing girlies at the mall. Two amazing girlies at the mall. I mean, I have their name in my head, but I don't want to mess up one of them. Um, they were just so amazing. So this is a shout out to my B-Squad. One was shy and one was at work, so we couldn't take any pictures or videos. But Danielle from Apple, big up yourself. Thank you guys so much for coming up to me. I really, really appreciate it. If you see me, come say hi. So Danielle, big up yourself. Thank you a lot. And Jaquana, big up yourself. She was so nice. She reminds me of Malik. And the long time people them know, my cousin Malik, they have this bubbly personality and she's just so funny and quirky. And that's exactly how she was when I met her. I really appreciate you and hopefully we'll buck up into each other December. So with that being said, I gotta go. I gotta go. Treat you like a friend. Just 
Fetch you like a love Hey guys, just came back from the gym. Just got back from the gym and I did a lower body workout and I did 30 minute inclined walk on the treadmill. I'm about to eat. The rest of my food that I got today is some like halal. Um, I can't even remember the specific name, but it's like rice and chicken and like vegetables and white sauce. I was also watching, um, what is it called? I was also watching Fast and the Furious Tokyo Drift to get me through the last 10 minutes of the walk. But since I lifted heavier today and I tried to lift for longer, I need to eat I'm seeing a difference in my body today marks week three I have three more weeks and then after six weeks I'm gonna switch up the workout and then do another six weeks so I'm going to Georgetown next week and I'm really hoping <laughs> this week really you know so I'm gonna push hard go harder today i think it will look fun all right there we go i'm going to georgetown on the 15th of august i'm so excited i think chad might come with me we'll see how it's looking we'll see how the load is looking i'm gonna sign him up so he could come on the flight with me um i'm gonna be the number one position so i'm really glad and it's a 15 credit i lied it's a 12 credit trip. I thought something said it was 15 credits. Yeah, maybe 15. Anyways, child. Um, I'll be in Georgetown, Guyana for 30 hours. So I think that will be a lot of fun. Position one, going from Miami to JFK. I'm, no, JFK to Miami, Miami to Georgetown. Then Georgetown back to Miami, Miami to JFK. Um, and there's a trip in open time for Kingston. Oh, for Kingston. <laughs> and there's a layover, a 14 hour layover. So I could have a layover in Kingston on Wednesday to Thursday. Um, same JFK to Miami, Miami to um, Kingston, and then Kingston to Miami, Miami back to JFK. But I'll be position two in the back girl but i love to get that trip so it's the only trip i bid for for the morning i'll go back to work if i don't get it i'll just bid for some higher time trips and hopefully them give me um oh my god i really want to get it i really want to get it but i'm gonna eat this food finish watch tokyo fast and furious tokyo drift and then um I'm going to go shower and edit. And that's going to be the rest of my night. I'm going to probably find a movie to watch on the TV after I edit. I think I'm going to edit for like 30 minutes. Because I want to upload my video on Wednesday. Anyways, I keep on talking. So. I'm looking, but if you want to, we could. How about you? Good morning, guys. I am. It's actually afternoon. It's 2:30 in the afternoon, and I'm heading down to the gym. I have my little um, BBL outfit on, my little Shein BBL jacket has a hoodie and everything i can't remember which video i did a haul for this in but it's on shein um it's a workout thing and i'm gonna do upper body today um i'm not gonna bring you guys along i have so many of the same upper body workout videos that i've done in other weekly vlogs so yeah 
I tried so hard to book some doctor's appointments um, this morning, but they just, I don't know. I hate booking my own doctor's appointments. Can we please go back to the time when we were younger and our parents used to do it? Because this is so ghetto. <laughs> it's so hard. I didn't realize that like the schedules, the timing, and me with my new career path, my schedules like... If you're not available on a day that I'm off, I can't tell you when the next time I'm gonna get used is, okay? So I may have like a reserve thing going on, but I don't know for sure if I'm gonna get used or if I'm not gonna get used. So I can't say, oh yeah, book me in for this day and I'll make it. I don't know. And then some doctors like, how are you booked for two, three months and you're accepting new patients? Stop accepting new patients. Because you can't be booked for two and three months and are accepting new patients. Because you want me to wait three months before I can get into your office? I need to find somebody else because, ugh, come on. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense to me. So I'm finding it a bit difficult with regards to, like, calendar issues. Um, finding them in the area is pretty easy. You know, the, the health plan that you're under and seeing their providers in network out of network but just the calendar like we just don't have the same schedules our schedules aren't aligning but anyways like i said i'm gonna head to the gym um you know what i'll bring you guys with me so every day i'm thinking of you oh yeah oh yeah yeah oh. got me feeling lucky I just finished off the workout with some sprints. And guys, that was that was one hell of a workout. So I'm gonna go shower and edit and eat. Good morning guys, I did a little something with my hair. We're on our way to Miami. There's nobody on the plane yet, but people should be coming down soon. So I'll see you guys when I get to Miami. I am in Cuba. I'm in Havana. All the passengers are off the plane. Guys, my edges. We shouldn't talk about it. All the passengers are off the plane and um, we have about an hour. They're doing a security search and they're cleaning and you know the pilots are doing what they gotta do. We did what we had to do already. So I'm just here chilling. I took some pictures. I'll pop them up. Matter of fact, you'll probably see one of them in the thumbnail already. So I'll be doing a turn in Cuba and going back to Miami. Then I'll be spending several hours in Miami. And then I can slam in the door. And then in Miami, from Miami we'll be going to San Juan and then spend several hours in San Juan. From San Juan back to Miami, then Miami back to JFK. So I'll be gone for three days, as I said earlier. But for now we just chilling. Um yeah, and that's it. I'll see you guys later. Bye. I've been waiting for you for a while. I've been waiting I'm going to do a quick room tour. This is the kitchen. A full kitchen with a fridge, a nice mini fridge. And we have a dishwasher right over here. Like, be for real, completely honest. You've never seen that anywhere else. And on top of that, they have a like a a cooker station like a stove i can't remember what they call this you you know what it's called but they have one in here ready for us to use and of course the infamous microwave where you may see one you may not see one but i'm glad we're seeing one today and a whole sink like this is a really nice hotel room you have your seating area and double beds you guys know how i feel about double beds i love a double bed if you don't know then go and check out some of my tiktok videos and some of my other YouTube videos where I talked about I love sleeping on one bed and eating on one bed. Or I love outside clothes on one bed, inside clothes on the other bed. Bye! On our way, this is my little outfit. Can't really see it all that well, but it's one of the shorts that I got from Abercrombie. I tied my hair back. Yeah. 
my crew member should be down here but I'm gonna just walk over here and see what they got in this little corner it's not bad at all all right let's go walk back to the lobby and see if she's here right, guys here we are in Joe's and I saw this mini beef tacos that I think I may get. But the thing is, it says conventional oven air fryer stove top. I don't know. I'm gonna get one. I think I may want the chicken. Should I get beef or chicken? That's the thing that I want. Beef or chicken. I'm gonna check the bag, see which one has more protein. 11 grams. Okay, it's the same. That's crazy. Give me a second. Let me decide which one I want and I'll be right back. It does. Are you going to pay with this? Can I? <laughs> hmm? Nowadays, you never know. You never know. I did forget my car, but I'm going to pay with Apple. Her, her lipstick the other day and she said she had a, had a custom made. Oh my God, Jesus. Wait, oh my God. Her lipstick. And then another lady paid with like this really ornate hairbrush that was wild to look. She just waved it and paid it. She had it, she had it made. You could put the chip in anything. Yeah. Well, no. They put them in dogs, they put them in, they want to put them in kids, so they shouldn't. I'm back at the hotel. And I wanted to show you the mini haul that I promised you. So of course I got the um the beef because why get beef when you could why get chicken when you could get beef mini beef tacos um I'm actually gonna open it up immediately and see what it's looking oh my god it's so tiny and cute it's a lot by the way everything came up to twenty two dollars which is a whole meal so me getting all these tacos for twenty two dollars I feel like is a steal the only thing. It, it, girl, I, mm, it can't be microwaved. It can only be air fried stovetop or conventional oven. And I don't have an oil for stovetop. And I don't even think we got no conventional oven with bacon sheet. Bake for five to seven minutes until outer edges are crisp. I may just throw it in the microwave and pray to God. Because whatever I do, it's going to get eight. Then. I got, oh my god, I forgot about these. I got these um, Volpe snacks. It's mozzarella and prosciutto. Let us try one of these right now. One of my videos I've been trying to upload from last night keeps getting um, demonetized. So I have it in the background now trying to upload it. It should be okay. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. This is a snack if I ever knew one. I got s'mores bars. Chocolate has been on my mind since yesterday. So, let's try this out too. Oh wow, look at it. Mm, okay, let's see what it's all about. I'm gonna have to put it in the fridge immediately. But this is what it's looking like. Let's try it. Mm. I'll wipe off the counter. This is delicious. Fudge brownie and a honey ground crust with marshmallow cream topping. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let me hurry up. Mm. Yeah. For beverage, I got banana and almond butter protein smoothie with coconut water and pea protein. And that's what this one is looking like. I'll try that later. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And I got kombucha, 
this flavor is passion fruit tangerine I'll try that later as well but for now mm -mm. the s'mores is really doing it for me mmm it's a chicken salad from 81st Deli superior <laughs> bye guys I'll see you later I think I had a genius idea guys because I didn't have any butter to cook these but since there was some meat on this I was like let me peel off some and drop it in the pot and make some oil which I think it worked because it made some oil the place they start smoke up so I did need to um take it out but I didn't have to time to show you but I'm gonna split these and I really hope they come out but as you can see on some of them like there really was some oil there so the way outside looks so crazy I've made an executive decision to stay inside and when I say it looks crazy I mean it literally looks like Canterbury one hurricane is about to come in it took me a while to think of that but that's what it looks like I'm gonna stay in and I'm going to watch my movies I'm going to sleep I'm gonna unpack my bag I have brought my air pod max with me which I think I'm gonna put on and listen to some like nice surround sound audio the towel from the people them bathroom um my room key which i'm gonna put over by my flight attendant stuff my little wallet pouch i'm gonna put back in my bag i'm gonna actually plug in my phone i'm gonna use my laptop because why is my phone on mute okay it's not i'm gonna use my laptop Put all my lotions and sunscreen back in their respective bags and my Ray-Bans back in my bag, my lip balm, <laughs> all of these things are going back in my bag and my bag is going back in my bag because we're going to lay down, eat, watch movies and go to sleep. Plus, I have to wake up tomorrow at 5.40 a.m. so best I just stay in. God is giving me a sign outside look like crap stay a yard so that's what I'm gonna do see you later good morning so I am basically all ready um the hotel has free breakfast so and the free the complimentary breakfast starts at um 6 30 so I'm trying to make my way downstairs for that. So it's 6.29 now probably. Last time I looked it was 6.28. Um, yeah, last time I looked I was 6.28. Um, so let's go get that free breakfast. I need to figure out what I'm doing with my hair, but for now, this is how it's going to look. That's my alarm to go off. So, 6.30. That means complimentary breakfast starts now. Plus, it looks so overcast. Hey guys, I am in San Juan <laughs> and, <laughs> and if you have not <laughs> if you have not checked out oh, if you have not checked out my previous San Juan vlog from when I went on the cruise then go and check that out I will leave that up here somewhere and I will also leave it down in the description box so guys welcome to the hotel we are in San Juan. Let me start off with the bathroom. How beautiful is the bathroom? You're not really seeing the beautiful part yet. The shower, bam. Like the tiles to um, 
just the hook oh how everything just blends seamlessly the appliance i don't know what you call the shower unit but it looks amazing and i really like black and wood and that's what they're going for and now let's head on over right when you come in the room they have this closet situation you know with your usual ironing board hangers iron and they have extra locations for the girlies that like to fold and hang their clothes we also have a full body mirror full body mirror and your typical setup with your complimentary water and your coffee and another mirror hey guys we have our mini fridge right to the left and of course our tv area to put our luggage we have a table here and a picture i'm going to get over to those but then we have a really nice bed set up i was telling my tiktok followers that i really liked the bed head that they incorporated the bed head into the the side tables and the light light fixtures the bed looks so comfy i can't wait to sleep in it tonight and of course they have an amazing painting to complement the beautiful ocean view or partial ocean view that i have right there and of course they have more seating areas and a table but let me get you into this ocean view guys y'all can't tell me nothing i really like this ocean view i think it i don't know it's just nice i saw some people jet skiing a while ago so i'm gonna head to the gym and meet my crew members down by the pool uh, i told them an hour so let me go change and go immediately hey b squad this is my post gym outfit let me show you in the other mirror i've already packed my bag but this is it my trusty flats you already know <laughs> and nice look a bikini so let's go to the beach and to the pool but yeah basically i'm gonna warm up some food first and then i'll head down bye okay so i'm at the pool um i just used like four different type of sunscreens from my crew members so i should not be getting burnt like i did in la huh oh it's not rubbed in still it's the oh oh i am crazy at least you guys saw the proof that i got sunscreen on all right guys i'm on my phone and i stepped to the beach i left my shirt back i think you can see it right here with my wine but i got my phone <laughs> we are going to the beach Beautiful, no? I'm sorry, the camera's upside down. Look at the crowd. There he is. Tomorrow's go home day, so I have two legs. Puerto Rico to Miami, Miami to JFK. And I'll see you. Oh! Wait, I'm I threw my watch out in the garbage. I've been walking around this whole pool searching, thinking a cat or frog ate my watch. It's in the garbage. Guys, I was never gonna get this watch back if I made my spirit. Like something woke me out of my sleep. Something woke me out of my sleep and I was like, check for your watch. I'm gonna show you. Let me know. I might as well just thank God it's waterproof. I need to take this glove off though, but I need to watch. Wash it off first. It was in my garbage bag. Like a garbage bag I threw out for the group. So I even put a message. This watch has been notified. I've lost and stolen. Because if somebody found it, like, oh, oh, thank God. And thank God it's not dead because a dead watch would not play any sound. A dead watch would not play any sound. I like to throw my used stuff on the, the ground. Good morning! 
I am back in New York, but I'm heading out again. The last clip that you guys saw was me leaving San Juan yesterday morning. So then I got back to New York around 3... Yeah, around 2.30. And, you know, got in and everything. I got assigned Rap B, which was at home standby from 5 a.m. to 5 p.m. And I got assigned a trip from Miami to Charlotte. Spend the night in Charlotte, Charlotte to Miami, and then back to JFK tomorrow. Well, today. Back to JFK tomorrow. Um, mommy went to buy gas. It's her time to buy gas, so she went to go buy gas. She said she's going to pull up. I honestly was supposed to leave 12 minutes ago in order to get to the airport by 3 o'clock. But my sign-in is not until 4.30. I'm on the phone with Kai, so if that's what you're hearing, that's what you're hearing. Um, Kai, say hi. Hi, guys. <laughs> Come home. come home yes i would love to come down to jamaica guys you know that oh i bid so hard oh i try to talk to you and i'm a bit so hard for your trip that was like an overnight trip in kingston there was like three of them i'm a bid for them kind i'm gonna end up getting the san juan trip but i'm a bid for them so hard I tell him they want to come back so bad and you don't see that often you don't see a jfk like a new york crew getting an overnight trip in in jamaica often mm -hmm. <sighs> i was so sad when i didn't get it um jfk to my let me see what time i have to sign in you have to sign in at 4 30 so i need mommy to like hurry up she's calling me okay look at god what? mommy i called me she'll tell me um she uh, uh, downstairs bye guys Hi. here waiting on the employee shuttle seems like it's raining like drizzling on and off um, fortunately for me the shuttle just pulled up but I'm on here and I found a really really good parking spot so I'm grateful when I come back tomorrow it's gonna be night so I really like to park as close to the pickup locations as possible and close to a light fixture like a, a street light so yeah we are heading now into JFK and I'll see you guys when I get closer to the terminal or when I'm on the plane before any passengers come Bye. I'm at my gate now guys my recent vlog that I uploaded is going really really well so thank you if you checked out that vlog. If you haven't, make sure you go and check it out. I'm at my gate early. Another thing I'm really grateful for, even though I had to go through an extra layer of security. Good morning guys. So I'm in Miami and I ended up having to stay the night in Miami. I hit my head on the plane um, and like a lot of stuff happened so they had me stay the night and now I'm going to fly back up to New York as a passenger and uh, yeah I'm just tired I got a little headache still overall I think I'm okay um, I'm waiting for the time to run off for my flight and I was gonna go to the clinic here in Miami but when I called in the morning they said the clinic is closed today so when I get back to JFK we'll see how I feel but I do have a day off tomorrow the only thing is I picked up a trip Tuesday so we'll have to see how that goes but I don't want to lose the trip I didn't want to lose the trip last night either but for the for the um, sake of my health and you know like just making sure everything stayed fine um, I just stayed uh, still have the same pain but 
Yeah. Um, I have a, a little gash on my head, and it's still like like elevated it's not like swollen when the medic did come on the flight yesterday they said um it wasn't big enough to do stitches but yeah it's still there i can still feel it right here and it goes from like here to here yeah may insert pictures depending on how i feel when i'm editing this but the flight um in the next like 45 minutes they should start boarding well, at least I can start boarding on the plane. Um, they got me going back on a health um, pass. Um, yeah. So, and I'm out for a sickness slash injury. Um, yeah. There's a lot of people here at the Miami airport. I don't know how loud it is. Hopefully the microphone is doing what the microphone should be doing. And yeah. When I go home, I may end off the vlog um, tomorrow. Um, and start back vlogging on Tuesday at my destination so stay tuned for that vlog and I hope you enjoyed this one and I will see you when I see you